Hi everyone, and welcome to another Xcode tutorial. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to make a simple login login screen. So in this login in this tutorial, we're going to learn how to make a login screen and obviously it's going to have a username text field and a password text field, right? So I'm just going to open up Xcode and get a new project. It's going to be a single B application. I'm just going to call it login login tutorial. I'm just going to save it on the desktop and I'm just going to zoom the window. <coughs> okay, here I'm just going to deselect these two and get a nice iPhone screen. Okay, now I'm going to scroll down and what we need for the storyboard, that's all we, all we need is to check here. I'm just going to duplicate this. I'm going to set this with 288 and this one to 288 like that and I'm going to have a label that says login and also a button say login. Okay, now I'm just going to set the background just in case we can a little better to orange. And I'm just going to have some placeholder text. This one's going to say username. This one's going to say password. And uh, here. I'm going to do secure text entry, like if you ever seen a text field and you enter text, it turns into dots. That's what it does. That's what this thing does. Okay, now I'm just going to go to vcontroller.h and, oops, I'm going to have two IB outlets for the to the text field, this one's going to be user name field and another one for the password field. And I'm going to have an NS dictionary for the username and password. Okay, and I'm going to have an IV action for the button. And I'm just going to type it in here. Okay, and inside here, we're actually going to view to load. I'm going to say Diction or sorry, uh, info dictionary equals brackets ns dictionary space dictionary with with objects for keys and in this one I'm gonna put ns array array with objects oops with objects this one. And inside here, I'm going to put password. And in here, I'm going to put the brackets and this array, array with objects. And inside here, I'm going to put username. And that's all I need. Okay, now I'm going to go to button tap to an if, I'm going to have an if else statement, and the if condition, I'm going to put brackets, dictionary info, dictionary object for key, and here I'm going to put ns, sorry, oh yeah, 
a username dot text. Oops, I spelled username field in vkcore.hrom. And I'm going to put another set of brackets. Sorry, actually, it's going to be here. Is equal to string, and it's going to be password field.text. Okay, and inside here, put UI alert, view space alert equals double brackets and I mean UI alert view allocate and it with title message delegate. So the title is going to be correct password. Message is going to be sorry. Inside message, I'm going to put the password is correct. The delegate is going to be nil or so. Cancel button title is dismiss. And other button titles is nil. So I'm going to get rid of this colon or comma. Put a semicolon at the end. I'm going to put alert. Dot, oh, actually in brackets, alert, show. Okay? That means you're going to show the alert to the person. Okay? And all you need to do is, I'm just going to copy and paste this into here. And the sign is going to be incorrect. And the password is incorrect. Don't and this all. Just gonna call it alert two and alert two. Oops. Sorry. Oh yeah. I'm supposed to put this in quotation marks. And here too. Right. Okay, now let's go back to the storyboard to link everything up. I think I right click here. And it will be this one's username field. And this one's going to be password field. And this one is going to be, it's going to have a touch from the side. And it's going to be button touch. And I save it and run on an iPhone 5S. Because we've been working with iPhone 5S. Okay, okay, just wait for it to load, and here it is. Okay, it's just taking pretty long, I guess. So I enter the username, say enter, I have to enter username, and in here I'm going to enter a password, 
and return. Oops, so we got the password wrong, and there's actually an error. So you switch these, two. that's sort of weird. And it should be good. And run again. Okay, now I'm just going to enter username. And here I'm going to enter password. And we did get incorrect. So let's enter a password. Okay, so actually, sorry, I was uh, wrong. You have to switch these two back. Okay, now we're in. Chicken pretty darn long. Stop it. Okay. Okay, wait for it to load. Should load pretty soon. Okay, there. I'll center the username. Okay, now it's not responding. Login. Okay, we got it correct. Now, if you got it incorrect, let's say I delete that, you get this and you can dismiss. Okay, so that's how it works. Okay, guys, um, thank you for watching, and I hope you see it in my in my other videos. Bye.